Hello, hello, hello. Good evening. How are we all doing? So, we are going to have a little fun with some colors tonight. We're also going to do uh, an abstract bag painting, uh, which should be super fun. Um, happy Sunday. Hope your weekend was good. Um, very relaxing and, and kind of lazy this weekend, but um, did some painting and, and some cleaning and stuff. I'm sure like everybody did. Um, so we are going to do some fun, creative stuff tonight. We're going to do um, kind of a sunsetty lake um, piece. Super fun. Easy to blend skies this way. So just follow along kind of, you know, if you have some, some stuff to do there, that's great. If not, um, you can watch this video again on my Facebook page. Um, and, uh, you know, we'll kind of go from there. So, um, without further ado, we're going to jump right in. Um, we're going to do a couple different things, like I said. Um, we're going to do two, two tonight at least. Uh, so we have a 16 by 20 uh, white canvas here, stretch canvas. Um, you can use canvas board if you like. Um, it's a little easier to find. Um, so I have some, uh, I use Master's Touch uh, acrylic paint. Um, it's, you get it at Hobby Lobby, it's a little thicker, it's very nice. See, it doesn't run. <laughs> it's very nice paint, it's uh, rather thick. So um, we have, uh, we got sky blue, we have some lemon yellow, um, and some basic orange. Um, so. Sorry, sometimes my, my, my internet must be kind of kicking in and out, so apologize for that. All right, so what I'm going to do is some of you guys look like your first timers, so I'm going to slide you over to the canvas here. Um, show you a couple of you what we did the last couple of days. We might do something similar to this too. Um, we got our nice, really awesome big pink canvas here that we've done. Done some really big pieces. Um, we also have this teal one, which I, I absolutely love. These are both done with... Uh, um, Nice big pieces. I mean, you know, be really great for a living room or something. So, um, both of those are done with uh, Q-tips. So, real helpful around the house. Real easy to do. Uh, everybody's got some Q-tips laying around. So, um, yeah. Um, still doing keto. Still losing weight. Still having fun. Um, eating steak and avocados and stuff. So why not, right? All right, cool. So enough about me. We're gonna turn you over to the canvas here. We'll get rolling here. Uh, just for those of you that haven't watched before, I am right-handed. Um, this is all in reverse. So um, if you're watching and um, first time and you see it when I post it afterwards and it's in reverse, you're like, what the heck? This is wacky. Uh, that would be why. So, all right. So I like to do my skies kind of on an angle. Um, so we're going to do, I'm going to kind of get this started. And I want to mimic this in the water. Uh, white paint or gesso for some of those you guys have painted before. Gesso is basically just a uh, uh, like a white primer. I'll put that down first to kind of blend my skies. I want this to be a little different so um, we're just gonna we're just gonna go straight to the canvas with this and we're gonna kind of mimic this. This is gonna be our water. We are gonna have a horizon line and we're gonna kind of just mimic this mimic the sky. So whatever we put in the sky, we're going to want to put down here or relatively close. Cool. Just a little bit of orange here. Totally fine. We blend some of this, so don't you worry. Whoa. Don't you worry. I'll slightest bit. Sorry if that keeps cutting out on you. I don't know for what reason my internet's being kind of wacky, but.
now. Throw in some of this yellow. Now you gotta kinda pick a spot where you want this sun to be um, if you're oranges and things um, we're gonna want an idea of where where our sun's gonna be and kind of play off of that a little bit and you'll see here in a second where we're gonna put that Okay, so just kind of blending all this stuff. A little bit of a horizon that's kind of taking place. If you guys have any questions or comments or anything, you can certainly leave those um, you know, in the comment section or you can send me a message. I usually will get to those when I'm finished. Um, all right, so we wanna make sure this is all blend it first. Cool. And then um, we're going to kind of pick pick a spot here. Probably right. That's about right where we want it. <clears throat> and kind of move this around just a little bit enough so that it looks more like like I'm gonna rub, rub over this here in a second but I just wanted to kind of even that out just a hair I have it seen. I have seen it done where you know folks will take um, like some tape and they'll put it on there. Um, tape off, you know, like about this time. All right, so. Kind of wisp through this. Dry brush here. make these lines long.
Sorry if I'm in your way here. Because if I really want... We're going to run, run a horizon in there. Definitely got that kind of foggy feel to it. Not soaking wet, but it's wet enough to kind of blend through some of this and give us a little, a little different look down here. This brush is just, just damp. It's not soaking wet. You don't see any water puddling up on here, but it is, it is damp. Make sure we're good. Cool. I'll hit a couple. I'm just grabbing some orange and some white. Or some yellow, I mean. Just gonna kind of hit whatever's left on here into the sky a little bit. I'm just gonna kind of blend off some of that. Gives it some ribbons in the sky. Cool. Yeah. Love it, love it, love it. Okay, so we do need um, our horizon, so we need some black here. This does not have to be exactly straight because um, you'll see why. Cool. There's a horizon, so everything below it is just kind of moppy wet and kind of different looking there. Um, Here we go. 
sister. Make sure there's nothing crusty on it. There we go. Just to kind of even that up a little bit. I'll throw some up here. some little sponges kind of sitting around uh, this one's kind of like a scabby I'm not going to use it for much um, so I'm going to use this one to kind of frame in some trees for us kind of cool now I'm not going to go all the way across with the tree I'm not going to do it on this side either we're going to have just a little bit of a gap in the middle um, which will give us little dimension to it, kind of showing more of the sun than anything. This just kind of fills it in for us a little bit. I mean, we're obviously going to go in and, and do some trees here, but this just kind of gives us a little bit of a filler, just so we don't kind of use a brush. And it gives us some different texture, which is kind of nice. Cool. Now that we have that kind of filled in, we'll also kind of fill this with a similar kind of texture. Not not like all of it, like we did up there, as thick as we are. Uh, because Stone we'll see why. Brings traditionally inspired casual comfort home, designed to marry farmhouse style, everyday family life. Each thoughtfully curated collection features pieces built with details, like hidden storage and stain-resistant fabrics for quick cleanups. Visit Amazon.com forward slash Stone and Beam to learn more. Cut stone and Beam, grab life well furnished. A dry brush. Should be relatively dry. It's got a little Give water on it. Something to and smile. Kind of right Introducing the Revlon, a new health and wellness brand from Amazon. Revlin has you covered with a full range of vitamins, supplements, and wellness products to support you from head to toe. Explore Revly's line of superfood powders that mix well with a variety of shakes and drinks. Revly is an Amazon brand and stands by its products. If you're not completely satisfied, we'll give you a full refund. Shop now at Amazon.com slash Revly. That's R-E-V-L-Y. I 
this edge to be a little darker. Um, and just kind of a little bit of a variance there. All right, so what we want to do is we grab a little fan brush there. So and we're going to make our little pine trees. trees there. Oh, I like those a lot. Definitely takes a little bit more hands-on type stuff here just to Just some hints of yellow along this lake shore. Gives us a little bit of texture difference for grasses in front of these pine trees, so it's not like straight subtle, but it's there. You'll be able to tell when you're looking up close to it. All right, time to do this on the other side. need a ton of black to do these because they feather out rather nice. This is 
little more delicate. But they're fun to do. yellow along this lake shore kind of gives us a little bit of a highlight kind of where that differentiates from the water back in here. We're not going to use as much yellow on that. We do want just a couple flicks of that. So you can kind of see that in that darker area, but we're going to bring this out.
probably should have more orange down in that water than, uh, than yellow. So we'll uh, finish off this yellow here and then put some orange over top of it. Hey guys, are you ready for elevated menswear that won't break the bank? Button down has you covered. With dress shirts crafted from the finest cotton and sweaters in premium cashmere, your wardrobe is sure to thank you. Looking great has never been so affordable. Discover Button Down exclusively at Amazon. The songs you want, when you want them. With Amazon Music Unlimited, you get all the music all the time, all without app unlimited. With spring in full swing, use Amazon it's totally Basics fine that we kind of like really highlighted vehicles. some of this because it's a growing selection um, of cabinet hardware, door hardware, faucets, light bulbs, and more. We're going to be Amazon able to Basics uh, has something for everyone. Some and with over 500,000 over five star so reviews to our name, you always deal. know you're getting a great product and an even greater value with Amazon Basics. Learn more by searching for Amazon Basics on Amazon or by visiting amazon.com slash Amazon Basics. Mix a little bit of black with some of the because we're gonna. These sides need to be a little bit darker because we have this kind of this central area here, and we don't want we don't want that sky to like be nice and dark, and then our water be like super bright because that's not how that's gonna work. if you're looking at like a, a centerpiece in this that's nice and bright like that sun that we had and then the further you get away from it um, you know we're gonna have these uh, darker edges to it so same with this over here we don't want this to be you know super bright yellow highlights and stuff it's gonna have more muted blacks and straight black but you know what I mean from that sky being the way it is cool I like that so we're also going to do
vamos a estar. Adding a little bit of texture to the bottom of this. Gives it some, some more reeds kind of feeling to it. So you can kind of turn your brush a little sideways sometimes, do some flicks that way. Or you can leave it flat and it'll give you that feel too. on this dealio. Boom. How y'all doing? All ten of ya. Cool. I like it. I like it. I like it. This little transitional sun set. Uh, I got our pine trees. Nice little lake in front. Sitting by your cabin, checking that out. Yeah, I think I'd be, uh, I'd be happy. <laughs> Perfect. Awesome. Cool, cool, cool. All right. So there's piece number one. Um, I'm ready to do... A little more abstract. Um, so we're gonna jump right in. All right, so we're gonna use a 12, 12 by 24. Um, I'm glad you like it. Um, we are gonna use, I'm gonna use a lot of white on this one. This is gonna be kind of fun. Because white really makes it kind of look cloudy. 
Um, so for those of you who have not experienced this, your bird tree, because we are going to have some fun. Phalo blue and some white. And I will show you what we're going to do. This is garbage bag or plastic wrap you can use. Um, I'm using um, a Hobby Lobby bag because why not, right? It's like sponsored. Um, I'm going to put the, the, the paint right on the canvas. We're going to smush it around and see what we get. And you'll see it and like it. And if you don't, that's cool. Art is an interpretation of your expression, so, and mine, I guess, right? So, let's get ready for this, because this is fun. All right, so, I'm gonna go ahead and kind of make a design, like, how I kind of want this to end up. Kind of gonna make it look like this, kind of this blue, blue, get all this white, It's gonna be kind of outer spacey, so not Kevin Spacey. <laughs> Hope you picked up on that. Um, all right, cool. So hopefully there's not a ton of rips and tears in this bag. There is on that side. Okay. Cool. Get all the stuff out of here. All right. Fun part. Make sure it covers the whole kit and caboodle ground. And the white is supposed to blend with this blue. We just want this to be really kind of a cool deal here. I do the furthest away I can first just because it's you know, easier to kind of move towards you as you go. canvas or all right you guys ready ready for the unveiling Here we go. Now, I like it, but I don't like it as much as I'm going to in a second. On top, this could end in disaster. This could be a disaster, but I don't think so. there. 
almost there. Somewhere there's a hole. Not done with that yet. In case you were wondering. So, give your body something to smile. Do, at. Introducing oh. Revly, a new health and wellness brand from Amazon. Revly has you covered with a full range of vitamins, supplements, and yet. wellness products that Ain't support that. you from head to toe. Explore Revly's line of superfood powders that mix well with a variety of shakes and drinks. Radley is an Amazon brand and stands yeah. by its products. If you're not completely so. satisfied, we'll give you a full refund. Shop now at Amazon.com slash Radley. That's R-E-V-L-Y. All right. With Amazon Music Unlimited, you get all the music all the time, all without ads. Start now free for 30 days. Just ask, try Amazon Music Unlimited. Free news automatically, cancel anytime. All right, I'm gonna wash that off, and I'm done.
Alright, let's take a look at what we got now. Super cool. Anybody think that's super cool? Cool, cool, cool. Uh, this is acrylic. Um, so it does have some really cool watery, splashy look to it. Um, you know, we kind of blended the background and then just kind of went for it with, um, with the palette knife. Just kind of spun that through there. Um, you guys can see this looks very wavy. Um, it's got some finer points to it. I love it, man. It looks <laughs> totally splashy. Uh, it's super cool. Uh, we speckled some some white, you know, some paint there at the bottom just to give it that splash feel to it. Um, but totally a cool accent piece there. Totally different than what we just got done doing um, with our sunset piece. Um, for those of you just tuning in, here's our sunset piece. Completely different. So it's good to be diverse and not just kind of stick to one thing. Um, you know, I like to experiment me. So um, hopefully you guys enjoy that tonight. Um, and uh, take care of you guys. Uh, take care of yourself. Um, you know, just because it's weekend's over doesn't mean uh, COVID-19 is gone. Um, so um, just be prepared for that. So just be safe. Wash your hands. Check on your loved ones via phone, uh, Facebook, you know, that sort of stuff. Um, you know, try to do try to do what you can for those folks instead of stopping over and, you know, that kind of thing. But um, And then kind of ration your stuff out. I mean, go to the bathroom still. So, <laughs> um, But I really appreciate you guys being here tonight, um, checking me out. Um, painting with Pete uh, also over on YouTube uh, to search Pete Walters um, and you'll see uh, my YouTube channel there um, all of my art is for sale so if there's something that you uh, like on there or you like from tonight um, let me know um, if it is sold I can certainly do my best to recreate it or give you something real similar to it um, so questions asked uh, where can I pick up inexpensive paint or canvases Hobby Lobby is the best um, to get bulk things, you can get a five pack of um, 16 by 20 white stretch canvases for $10.99. Always, they always have a sale on for that. Um, it says five, five of them you can try out for 11 bucks. Um, I would start with paints, probably, um, um, you know, just small little tubes here. You can get these at Walmart, Meyer, um, you know, little hobby stores. They, they're less than a dollar, less than two bucks a piece, and you can play with them. They're gonna be a little thinner. Um, you're not gonna be able to do like what we did with this palette knife where you're cutting through the paint because thicker acrylic paint, we can use those kind of things and, and do some more fun stuff with that. Um, you get a lot more texture with those thicker stuff, um, but um, you can get those at, at Walmart, um, you know, your, your local. So yeah, any other questions, certainly put them in the comments. I'll try to get back to you afterwards. Um, and I appreciate you guys hanging out. We'll catch you later. Bye.